Hi, welcome to Buzz, Indiana's Underground Business Voice. My name is Tony Selzo. We're here at 465 in Michigan. I got Jack Kirkland with Kirkland right. Piano Service. Right. Really, a, a unique business. I mean, your <laughs> piano service, your tune and service pianos. Right. Now, how did you get into this? Well, I was in college and uh, saw a guy tuning, and I, I've, I've played piano since I was nine. Okay. So I was curious. Oh, well, there's a course being taken, you know, at another college. Okay. At a music college, and uh, so I took the course, and I thought it'd be a nice sideline. Uh huh. I still think it'd be a nice sideline. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, I know how that goes, right? <laughs> but uh, ended up for about ten years as sideline, and it became full time. And wow. So do you do you teach piano or do you? I, well, I used to. Okay. And then I even taught school for okay. about four years. Taught music. Okay. And then uh, went to work on a master's. Never finished it. Okay. The sideline became full time. Really, I started a, with stores and. Uh, your business has been a pursuit of your passion. Yeah, kind of. Yeah. yeah. So so how do, how do you um, how do people find out about you now? Well, I advertise on Yellow Pages. And okay. Word of mouth and uh, I get a lot of. Referrals and okay, so people find somebody that they, that has a piano and they say, "Hey, do you know anybody that fixes that or tunes it?" And right. you're the guy. Yeah, I tune for Indianapolis Public Schools. Okay, I'm the piano tuner. Okay, and uh, get a lot of referrals through that. Uh huh. Sure. Connections. Yeah. And I can imagine people calling the school and say, "Who rainmakers and I Yeah, <laughs> get yeah. Some, get some connections. Good, good. So, um, what is the um, what is the one thing that you think people think they know about your business that they they probably don't really understand? Can somebody? What is the difference between a good piano tuner and a bad piano tuner? That's a good. <laughs> yeah, I ran across a couple of bad ones. Yeah, because <laughs> you go there and you and get I've on it. I've had to retune. You the have piano. to fix their stuff, yeah. right? Yeah. Right. Uh, knowing what you're doing, you know, knowing what to listen for. Okay. And, uh, so um, you have to have the ear. Yeah, a trained ear. Okay. You, know, you have to have some knowledge of music. Not necessarily be a great piano player, but you have to have certainly a keyboard knowledge of intervals and scales. Now, now, Jack, are these pianos normally in larger, more expensive homes? I mean, do people tend to be more affluent that can afford well, to have, or do they just... Usually, generally, those who have a piano are people that have income, although I've been in some very poor homes. Yeah. And I've been in very rich homes. So. <laughs> just depends, right? Yeah. Yeah. So the habit really, it's really what your focus is on anybody that, that plays consistently is somebody you need to know and to rub elbows with because sooner or later they're going to need you. Right. Because they always go out of tune, right? Yeah. So um, what was the one thing you would like people to know and understand about your business that maybe they don't really, in, in three words or less, they could, they could, you would want them to understand, you know, Jack the Piano Guy? Yeah, I try to, try to please. Yeah. I'll, I'll do extra if I need to. There's a little service that needs to be done with the, I know it's not playing a sticky key or something. Uh -huh. I won't, won't charge any more for that unless it's... Unless it takes a lot of time. Sure. If something broke, that's different. There's all kinds of businesses within Rainmakers, and, I'm, and, and there's all kinds of different niches and different amazing value propositions that people create um, different types of businesses and services out of. And, and I'm just excited to have first time ever on the buzz, a piano <laughs> tuner on. Okay. Jack, I appreciate it. You've well, been buzzed. You. My pleasure.